Welcome back to my LEGO vlog. If you've been following my channel for a while, you saw me build this set. This is LEGO Creator 31025 Mountain Hut. I built the main build from this and I had a lot of fun doing it. I thought this set was just awesome. And I wanted to build one of the secondary builds. So if you look on the back, these are the two that I had to choose from. You have just this little standard cottage down here. And then this one, which I thought was the more interesting of the two, it's sort of like a, a mountain perch with a, a kayak or a canoe and the whole works right there. So I thought that's the one I'm gonna have to build. And that's what I did. So I'm gonna take you over to my work bench here and I'm gonna show you what I came up with. Here's the finished build. I think I'm gonna call this build the mountain perch since there's a little cabin that's sitting up on top of these rocks. It's sort of like a perch. This is a much smaller build than the original mountain hut. Here's all the pieces that were left over. I keep everything in a bag just to keep it organized. But there was a lot left over and it went a little bit quicker in building and it is just as high quality as the original mountain hut. Now the first thing I'll show you was the last thing that I built in this set. This is the little rafter guy. I don't know if he's supposed to be in a kayak or if it's supposed to be a hollowed out log. It could be one or the other, but that's what he looks like. He's got a oar inside there, got the helmet on. Looks really good. This is the mountain climber from the previous build, and I really like the, the oar and everything. It's just a really nice little build there. Now back to the mountain perch, there is a lot of detail that goes into the landscaping, and that's where most of the time was spent building. It really wasn't about the actual perch, it was more about the things that are around it. And we'll start out front with this tree right here. That was one of the later builds, but it is a really nice tree. You got a woodpecker on the side, and it's kind of nice because you can move them up and down like that. There's another little bird on top, and there's a ladder on the side, so the tree has a lot of detail to it, and I really like that. As you can see, there's lots of flowers around on the rocks back here. There is a piece of water that kind of goes through here, and then there's a cook stove out front, which you can take that off, and there's a pot there with fire under it. And then over here, sorry I keep moving this around making the sound, but I kind of want to show this to you with a little bit of detail. There's these steps that go up, and if I zoom out a little bit, you can see this little walkway that leads across here. There's a lantern there. And then if you look here, there is some steps that lead up inside the perch. And inside the perch, as much as the lighting really doesn't want to work with me here, there is an orange and white bed right there with a pillow in the back. And then beside that is a cook stove. There's really no room inside this place. This is what you would really call a, a tiny home because there is the bed and there's a cook stove. There's a little uh, coffee cup that's on top of that. On the side, there is a doorway, but there's no door. And then it has that log cabin kind of feel to it with the interlocking wood that goes up and down, mostly logs. And then on the front, you have a window which opens and closes. And if I come out just a little bit more, you can see a detail right above the window. I don't know if that's supposed to be some horns or something. And then on top, there is some moss and stuff growing up on the roof. And that is pretty much everything about this. It kind of just goes around. And uh, most of it, like I mentioned, was all about the, the landscaping. So the tree and the stuff out front. But uh, overall, not a bad build. Kind of just a lot of building up. There's a, there's a hole right there. You can go back here inside the cave. There's obviously something down here. It's like one of those little rubies. I'll pick it out so you can see what it looks like. It was in the other cave as well. I kind of like that. I don't know if it's a ruby or a crystal or what it's supposed to be. But you can go inside the, the cave that's under the the perch and go inside there. There's just all kinds of stuff to do with this. And There you go. That's a look at the secondary build from LEGO Creator Set 31025 Mountain Hut. I'm calling this one Mountain Perch. I had a lot of fun building it and I had a lot of fun sharing with you. I thank you for watching this LEGO vlog and I will see you in the next one.